Hello and welcome everybody, I'm Ultra Pavarian and this is Crusader Kings 2 and we're here is King Deer and King Deer has a plan. After the grand expedition for the east where we, you know, found spices first of all but also found us some concubines that will now be able to educate our children and so on and so forth making us a Hindu dynasty technically, I mean not yet, but you know King Deer knows there is a future in that. He has planned to leave these villages behind, these just empty places that honestly he kind of regrets conquering I feel. So instead what he wants to do is he wants to get rid of this land and instead claim his future over here in good old England. Now for that I already declared a prepared invasion on King Ethelwulf of Vichy and you know what that's probably not how I pronounce that. Vitze? I, I, I don't know how you pronounce that. Let's just take it from him and regret nothing else okay. In the meantime we are of course sieging here. I don't see anything else that I want to do for the moment. And I think that is it. Let's just unpause. We should get, hopefully get, a bunch of soldiers now in the events of the prepared invasion. We are stronger than he is. So this should make it even easier for us to gain soldiers. But even if not, we have a lot of money. We can do a lot of things here. So far, fairly unlucky, but that is okay. Not a single soldier so far. Are you serious? Oh, no. One of my concubines has already passed away. Do I have... Hey, you. I'm gonna put you under house arrest, okay? I'm gonna put all of you under house arrest. Don't die early. That is all I can say. Wait a minute. You're not important because you are not Hindu. House arrests. House arrests. You know, they may try to flee when they are on house arrest, but I think I'm going to push my luck and at least attempt where these fellas, you know, do something of value. Your children aren't here, right? Yeah, your children are not actually here. Can I sell you? Honestly, if I could, I would. But I definitely cannot sell you, so I'm just going to throw you... Nope. Put in house arrest. There you go. It all hinges on this prepared invasion succeeding. And let me tell you, so far, I suppose we may have reached uh, the threshold where we are too strong. And the game has decided to not give us any troops whatsoever. Because we are not gaining anything. Well, at least we have this money here, which is very beneficial. During the past few months, Ahiva Devi was showed dog de uh, has shown dog, de ex ugh, dog de determination in studies of our language. And has now also ex expressed a desire to study the history of my people's ancestors. And no, I think that is okay. Oh, and we can actually open the chest we looted in the last episode. What do we get? 200 gold? He fits the locks and trembling with anticipation you slowly open the chest. It is filled with ancient gold coins carved with the likeness of the long dead emperors of Rome and words written in their strange language. Easiest money I have literally ever made. Literally the easiest money. Look at you, you're pretty decent. That, that's a pretty good guy. And I would love to marry you to a Hindu lady. Where do they show up in this one? We do have them in prison of course so I know they're here. Just gotta find them. Mm, apparently not. Well... Let me just arrange a betrothal. Oh, I can't actually do that until they grow up and then I have to give them to him as a concubine. So, I guess until then, I'll go along with it and I'll name somebody that is good at... What about fighting? I like fighting. No, this one will be one of the strangest marriages. Aiton. Hello there. And it is the clan too that like is raiding us or was raiding us. You know what? This is a peace deal, clans. This is a peace deal between you and me until I leave, you hear me? I do not want to become the king. Uh, I think I'm going to save my... I'm going to save my ambition until we are in England so that I can claim become king of England as our duty. So I'm just going to not pick anything. That's okay. I don't need to pick anything. Speaking of picking anything, when do I need to pick this war? May 881. Alright, good to know, good to know. Nope, don't open this letter. She does not understand the concept of privacy. She is also an imbecile, just to be fair. Uh, so, you know, maybe she doesn't even grasp the concept on a very basic, abstract level. And I actually want to keep sieging here. Nope, that's not a siege. What about you? During the past few months, Zaina Hibita has shown dogged ex Lick, look. I don't actually want you to get my customs. I want you to have yours. You know, be happy with what you have, my friend. A small spear throwing competition could be entertaining and it's also a great way to live in your battle technique. Maybe you should arrange a contest at your court? Of course. After dozens of spears have been hurled through the air, Sol Victor emerges. No one managed to throw farther than Yeshislav the Messi. What a name. And honestly, look at him. Why does he like us so much? That is crazy. Despite, of course, you know, being Russian and Slavic, he's very positive about us. I suppose it's the personal promise. You know what? I'm going to marry you for this, for this win that you just experienced. You are... 
Lucky enough to marry a Norse lady. Mm, all of those would make him leave my court. You know what? Sure. Leave my court, friend. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you the benefit of no longer having to live in Russia, you know? That's the dream of all Russians, isn't it? <laughs> kidding. Just kidding, okay? Violence seems to be able to solve all of your problems. Life is easier when you can simply smash things into submission. Sounds about right. And of course, with that, he is gone. Hello, my son. Why don't you gather some prestige? And I would also like to make you the designated regent, of course. Uh, law speaker is always great. And that's it. Okay, perfect. Are we are we looking here in terms of laws? I could push this up. Because we do, you know, technically, if you want to reform to a feudal or a merchant republic, you would have to use this tribal organization. And the thing is, I will not be able to get rid of it because my last tribal holding is here, meaning we will be holding on to this even if we conquer England. At least as this person. Once we have transitioned to England, our son can hold a castle over there and that will be fine for him. Let's just go through with this. Can I do one more? There you go. Everybody says yes. There you go, except my spy master, that's okay. Ooh, don't fight me, please. Oh, you know what? I'm getting out of, out of your way. So yeah, we're getting zero troops because we're already too powerful in comparison to you. Look at him. And he is attacking him in the Ulstrian Holy War for Sudria. Man, I am very curious how many people will try to aid him. The entire north has fallen. This is under Yilin's control, this is under Jovik's control. If France comes in, we may have a bit of an issue. That is the biggest, the biggest issue we may face right there. If France indeed comes in, I need to be worried. And speaking of worried, I am actually worried because I will not be able to transport all of my troops in these boats. Oh, yeah, look at this. And somebody pointed out, dude, there totally were people with boats. Oh, my, by God, dude, they have so many troops, I can't hire them. You're entirely correct, of course. I was blind yesterday. There were people with boats, but I can't hire these. That's that's not going to go well if I were to hire them. I will not teach you about Odin. Absolutely not. No. Get out of here. No. Don't let me teach these kids about Odin. That's all I can say. How strong are you, actually? Hungry? Wait, what? Oh, this is part of Hungary, huh? Hungry, hungry hippos, excuse me. I'm gonna beat you up. Uh, I'm gonna make a move, of course. You know, sure. I went to I Aiton's chamber and gave her a good tumble. Sure, let's do it. It's good to be the king, isn't it? It is good to be the king. I'm so sorry, my son. Alftan, listen. Not everything can go in the perfect, you know... Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but... Hey, your wife was just, you know, I've seen her when I plundered this earlier. After her people plundered me. Oh god, you have become far too powerful for your own good, if you ask me. I don't even want a non-aggression pact. I've, I've seen her beforehand, you know, and... What can I say? Love is what love is, right? Oh, we're no longer brave. I did not understand fear before, but once you have felt your legs shake and teeth chatter with fear, then it is hard to remain brave. Damn, that sucks. May 881, and zero, zero troops have arrived. That is a shame. I mean, we are just too strong in comparison, but come on, game. Hopefully, she will be able to persuade her husband to be the real father. Oof. Uh, <laughs> son, how are you doing, buddy? How are you, how are you holding up there? Anyway, let's do what must be done. Prepared invasion of England. Now, Ulster, or Ulaith, I should say, is going to help them. I don't even know. There they are. Actually, Ulster. All right. Prepared invasion of England. It's time. I could just do a normal conquest. This is ridiculous that I have this range. Absolutely insane. Okay. Let's get as many people on the boats as we can. Try to figure that out. 2,800 seems the best that we can do indeed. Let's bring him over, boys. Who else is joining? Oh my god. I'm going to lose this. And then I'm going to lose subscriber. Hmm. What do you do here? I can't take out a loan. Could I theoretically? If I get you with the boats, I can send you over immediately. I'm losing already 2.59. I couldn't employ you for longer than just a very, very limited amount of time. Let me ask you something. Where are your troops and where are they going? Nulaith. Interesting. 
Man, that's so many people that joined in there. Yeah, I this is what I feared. On their own, they do not have many troops. But like this. Hey Jovic. How you doing, buddy? How you doing, buddy? How do you feel about this? Very good, very good. Be less noisy, please. Thank you very much. Now you do still go there, thank you. Hey Jovic, why don't you why don't you help me, huh? How about we form an alliance? Let's go, Jovic. So, essentially, he invited us to England, okay? That's the official narrative here. Thank you for joining my call to arms. That is how it's always supposed to be. We have to work together. We have to stand together if we are to take what needs to be taken. Now, what about you? Hello there. Nope. Also, you are a genius. I do not want to marry you off. Mm, can't do that, but that's okay. What's his war here? What's Jorvik's war? Aaron Holy with a meter. Interesting. Are you actually coming in the boats? If they are coming from my home territory, that could be disastrous, but I don't think they are. I'm gonna land right here. Just for starters. And I don't think I'm gonna hire the ones with the boats. I think I'm just gonna hire a different, a smaller mercenary company that I can keep around for much, much longer. Look at this price! This one, because it doesn't have boats, costs so uh, little money in comparison. You know what? Why don't we pr uh, bring the Cumans over to England? I can only imagine how Aiton must feel, as if being unable to publicly declare her feelings for each other was not enough. She now must lie about the fruit of our love. You know what? I, I can't visit you, actually, because I am in England. Sorry to tell you. Here we go. Hmm... Jovic, Jovic, Jovic. Can I aid you in this in any way whatsoever? I don't think I can. Alright, let's go. Let's go home. I think we can even do this alone if I do have the mercenary company, but having Jovic as our friends, it's a good start and it's a good thing altogether. Teach him to be less nosy, absolutely. You all are under house arrest and you know it. Alright, let me take a look at this. So, I can... I think I'm gonna pick you up. Because then I can actually transport everyone over. At least I think I can. Should be able to do that. Yeah, the Pechenay company. I can't do the Cuban company. Now that I look at it, they're actually simply too big for me to properly do that. I'm gonna pick you up and then we should be able to get on those boats. Oh, and I no longer... Jesus! I made a child with her! And then the child is just... I'm just like, nah, dude, I'm bored. I don't wanna... I don't care for you anymore. I've done things little third is his. Well, well, well. I'm so sorry. And uh, no. No, 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 no. Keep your ancestry, okay? Don't even sweat it. Alright, let's go. This will be a victory. It, it, it will be a victory, primarily. Because, well, now I have all my troops over here. And this should be enough. If this isn't enough, then I don't know what will be. Let's try to take their actual capital immediately. And I will also tell you to attach to me whenever you are free. I know, I understand right now you're not free. Ooh, look at this. Okay, where are his troops and how strong is he? Wiltshire. Ivar Davies has a favorite toy is missing and she won't go to bed without it. It might may I may have thrown it out today when I was tidying up. I'd offer to buy a new one, sure. Hello, fuzzy girl. Okay, that's a big army. Much bigger than I can deal with. I've gotten an increased amount of questions from Suvratas. Nope. Don't don't want to tell you about Odin. Sorry to tell you. Ooh, this is a, this is a bad one. Yeah, this was a bad one. Throughout the day, you've caught yourself grinding your teeth and being unable to focus on anything for long. Suddenly, you realize why you've been in a mood a bad mood all day. You just can't seem to abide having lazy people in your presence anymore. Aralt of Sitomir. Jitomir. I'll get to be less slothful than when I'm around. See... Hmm. I do not like him, so let's just do it. You know, it, it puts some stress and some pressure on him, but let's just do it. This was terrible. This was just straight up awful. Rise of the Shia. The fools fight among themselves. Okay, where where you at, bro? Ah, interesting. So, a very central point could fall to the Shia, which is actually usually, you know, a lot of fun whenever that happens. No, don't do this to me! Game, you can't do this. Where's my shattered retreat? Are you kidding me? Oh. Game, please. This is just incredible. Oh, man. This is just... Come on, man. 
This is actually incredible. I, I absolutely hate it. How did that happen? Game, you can't you can't do that sort of thing. You just can't do that. You just can't do that. Well, it is looking rather dire for what we want to do here. And I don't know if we can pull it off at this point. Looking at it, right? What do you do? What do you do here? I could just take... So I could just go on theoretically. And just declare a conquest war against somebody else with the mercenaries that we already have here. And we could probably make it over. But I would have to, uh, to dissolve all of those troops. And that's not really what I want to do, is it? What are you doing down there? Get out of there. Not that I can do anything about it, to be fair. But still, do get out of there if you can. And um, you are not at war with me, are you, Strathclyde? Oh, no, you totally are. Well, let me stop you right here. Nope. He's actually... He must have an organizer. Oh, I'm not even in the army? What? How would I do that? Oh, because I think there was sickness around or something. I can't remember. Well, this sucks. Um, huh. Nope, I will not be converted. Thank you for asking, though. This war appears to be over. Is this true? Nope. 7%. Jesus. This keeps on going. Hmm. Did I actually screw this up? Because it certainly does look like it. I'm going to teach you about organizing. There you go. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful, my son. Now, don't talk about... The weird way that your girl, uh, that your daughter looks like me, okay? That's just, you know, it's your genes. Whatever, bro. I'm going to teach you in diplomacy, sure. During the past few months, Aiva Devi has shown... No, stop this. Listen, I allowed none of you to have interest in my culture. I actually just lost troops there. Are you kidding me? These nonsense sieges. And this is why I was a bit frustrated to see that we didn't get any troops. And now you actually are seeing me in a, in a bit of trouble. And in a world of hurt. I'm losing so many tr uh, troops in this stupid siege. Did you see this? Good God. Good God is all I can say. Yeah, I don't I don't think I can pull this out. I think this is actually just a lost invasion. I can't go against that many. Oh my God. Yeah, this is a lost invasion. Um, That sucks so much. That sucks so much. Huh. Well, you know what? I think... I think this will be fine. Oh, God. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm, I'm gonna lose the prestige. I'm gonna lose the piety. It pains me so much, but I cannot win this. Ah, okay. That's fair. I mean, it's not actually... I'm, I'm actually really mad. But at the same time, you know, what am I gonna do about it? I don't want to dissolve you here, but I do want to separate them. Split of mercenaries, and then split of event spawn troops, and then you are the actual retinue. Hello there. You've not forfeited your office. You are my son, despite, of course, me hating corruption. It doesn't hate corruption. I'm going to keep the mercenaries around for just a second, because what I need to do, I need to get an actual foothold in England. And we can still do that. It's just going to be a slower conquest, because, well, I screwed up, as you were able to see right there. I think I should be able to take just some of these coastal counties right over here. During the past few months, Bogavati has showed dogged determination. Right, stop doing that. I don't know why it's showing uh, why it is showing this event if I'm not focusing on heritage or religion. So you know why is it even doing that? But that's okay. We're gonna we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna be fine. You know how it is. Sometimes things don't go your way, but then at the end of the day, they do. That's just the way the cookie crumbles. You are way too powerful. Maybe you are declare he's just too far away. Oh, this is real bad. Hey, how you doing, buddy? How are you doing, buddy? Not very, not very well, are you? We've raised any army levels? Are you kidding me? Oh, must be down there or something. Hey, Sudrear. Subjugation. Dude, that's actually like such a really good war goal. <laughs> sure, I guess. Let's see where I can siege. Everything else is already sieged. People are attacking him from all sides, it seems. <clears throat> I can't even really take this. What are you? Not independent. Oh, you know what? Why can't I declare war against you? Come on, where's my... Ah, dude, I'm actually just... None of this is okay. I'm not going to win any of this. Um, I could, theoretically, and I think... Oh, we have a truce. God damn it, what about you? Oh, we can actually do this. Oh, okay, we are in. 
We are in. I'm going to take Wessex. Straight up. I will also call you in. You're still busy, which makes me very annoyed, but here you go. Let's take it out. And we imprison him on his own island. He has to actually ship out. That is amazing. Nope. Don't don't want you to annoy me anymore. Get out of there. Um, You are a genius. And you know what? I'm actually going to teach you in etiquette. Because I want a genius person in charge of everything, if possible. Now, these mercenaries right now are our best friends. Let me tell you straight up. They are simply our best friends. Because only with them will I actually be able... Ooh, an elusive shadow, really? That is crazy. That is actually crazy. And you don't want to buy her, so you know what? There you go. Sorry to tell you. Sorry to tell you. Wessex will be under our control, which is very, very nice. Oh, stop asking about my ancestors, I swear to God. My friends have arrived. Come on. Really? Oh, there you go. That's what I wanted to click in the first place. A county in my domain is riddled with disease. I need to send Stuart Gordy Stein there. He will surely know what to do. Right, and we are also at war, of course, with you, which should be fairly easy to take care of. Oh, actually, look at this. Good God, are you friends with Yiland? Nope, you aren't. What happens? What is happening here? It must be this war. Yes. Oh, that sucks. I don't want to get involved in that then. If he brings the Doomstack over here, we are screwed. So let's not even try to deal with that. Get them out of here. All right, you know what? The prepared invasion fell, uh, failed spectacularly. But this conquest war, which uh, we can do just, you know, by the slither of our diplomatic range, this will not fail. And that is at least a small victory. At the very least, a small... Stop asking about Odin, I swear to God. They're so curious about Odin. Every other day, they just say, Hey, what about the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Where's Odin in all of this? Alright, this one has been done. Winchester's ours. And I'm not at peace, which means... Oh, and also, this is not our capital duchy yet. Um, I think we're just going to go with a conquest here, and I think we want to go for Sussex. I just need some coastal counties, I feel. Then again, uh, yeah, you hold nothing in my duchy, so I think... You know what? We could go with Middlesex now that I look at it. Would split this off most certainly. You know what? Absolutely. Let's go with Middlesex. There we go. That should do just fine. I'm going to call you into all wars. Of course you're going to hate that. I mean, who wouldn't? But I'm going to teach you a lesson for resisting my prepared invasion. How dare you? How dare you? You coward. You absolute coward. Also, they're descending on this, meaning that I will, I'm going to beat them up in my own land. Of course, you know, how else could I? There you go. Go get him. We are a bit faster than our ally here as well. Man, what a very strange way to come here to England, but we are doing it. The Arta must learn on our own, sure. That's okay. Uh, how are you doing? Are you still that other- Oh, no, he is not meaning. I can actually beat him up properly now. I'm a big fan of that, no doubt about it. They are sieging this, but it's not actually our capital, and we can immediately retake it. I'm not worried. Not worried at all. Let me read. Uh, oh, too slow. Let me take you. As I enter my chambers, all of the work I had done in my spare time seems to have been cleaned up and put back. Books are neatly set in alphabetical order, and notes have been thrown away. Malamatra Gunamarana? Oh, my God. Gunamahana Vason, Alinga Ganga. That is such a long name. <laughs> why does he? Na why is he named Son? Oh wait a minute. Excuse me. I accidentally converted you. I didn't mean to do that. I, I need a new generation of uh, of Hindus here. You're a Hindu, aren't you? You're, oh no, you're Muslim. You are Hindu. Yes, you are Hindu. I'll mess up his chambers. Absolutely. I will mess up his chambers, and he hates me for it, but you know, that is what he get, you coward. Alright, we are doing well. This war will be over soon, then we can turn north and, uh, you know, get a bit of a bigger realm. Tend to my son immediately. No, I do wish I could move my capital there, but we're going to take a look at that right after these wars are over. Because that is quite important to me, to actually move the capital and not lose these titles. How did you die here? Come on, man. Disagreement with the meal, food poisoning, so I couldn't even have influenced it. Oh, god damn it. Well, welcome home, girl. Dude, hello. You're not even going to lose any titles at this rate. I'm going to teach you an etiquette, of course, Holmga. Um, I will take Holmga, and honestly, this is perfect, because he will be the perfect fusion 
between India, the Norse, and England. The perfect fusion, let me tell you. I think I need to beat you up. Nope. They just didn't actually go. My wife is pregnant, thank you very much. And not siege as long as they're not sieging it, I can siege this time. We get 100% middle sex is ours. Thank you very much. Now, with that being said, we are doing a subjugation war. Which would give us so much more land, which is why I want to hurry a bit. You know, it, it needs to be done. Our borders are terrible, of course, but that's just medieval England, really. I'm just looking at the that the enemy isn't coming for us, okay? That is all I'm doing here. There you go. We're suddenly up to 7%. That is the dream. Let's take them out. Let's take them out, indeed. Eric. Hello, Eric. How are you doing? Queen Sif of Kunugadra named Eric. With two sons, we are looking at losing titles again. Which is a bit of a shame, but you know what? I mean, the second son can, can, have, can just have our Russian titles, really. There's not that big a deal in that. Nope, I don't care that you siege that. Listen. Oh, are people actually voting for him? Because I guess he's the primary... Uh, he's the son of the primary wife. I mean, uh, that, I guess that's kind of fair, but I would prefer the other one on the throne. In all fairness. 42%. Oh, are they... Did I just see... Okay, uh, you know, just looking. Just looking. Okay. So far, so good. We are making a very weird entrance into England, but we are making an entrance. And we are also running in the woods to become a better warrior. That is great. Oh, we are brave again. Yes. Thank you for voting for Holmgar. I appreciate it a great deal. I do appreciate it a great deal. The money here in Faith Triumphant does not mean anything to us. Let's go up there, let's beat them up, let's teach them a lesson, and then let's make them our vassals. Nope, where are you going, buddy? What do you what do you think you're doing? Does everybody have an organizer? I swear to god, everybody has an organizer. Everybody's so fast, including myself. Straight up, I think we're all organizers. Oh, I'm not even actually in. Did I not as auto sign commanders? Oh no. And we don't even have anybody. Well, I mean, we will win nonetheless. This will be a very easy victory. And there you go. The war's over. And we all of a sudden have a goddamn domain in this country. So here's my question, right? The Duchy of Man. I hold none of these. Meaning that this is a bit of an issue in case... Uh, I want to move my capital, right? I can't move it here because this is not the Jura and I've already moved it in the past. Remember, I moved it down there so that we wouldn't get sieged out. Now, if I create the Duchy of Man, I could I could put my capital down here. It is even tribal. This is kind of perfect. I will be honest with you. This is actually kind of perfect. But he does have 2k troops of his own. Are you insane? Where does he get those troops from? How much does it cost to create these? 100? 159. I have a very limited amount of time afterwards. Uh, and I can't actually revoke titles because we don't know the laws, do we? I can't... I could push, uh, push it through, potentially. Let me just actually take a look at this. Yes. You, both of you are old. You can give me the support. I don't really, you know, care about me owing you a favor. I'm just going to go through this so that we can get it done ASAP. One more. Thank you very much. Let's push it through. Boom. Title revocation allowed. You know how it is. You know how it goes. And this is interesting. We do have some people here that we can simply sell. And I think we are interested in that. Let's sell anybody that is irrelevant to our cause. Oh my god, dude. Sign Yabita. I'm so sorry. I am so, so sorry. But give me all your money. Alright, so what we're going to do now is, you know, the best thing that I could do. The Duchy of Man rises up. I will make it my primary. Ooh, that's a, that's a different color right there. Yep, 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 yep. That's a different color for sure. Um, let's take a look at different plots that we can do here. I would like to revoke this county. Thank you very much. I will position you on top of it. Nope, I will not fall for your nonsense. And then I need people to actually join me in and nobody's joining. God damn it, I need this to actually go through. I could just revoke it, I guess. How old am I? 42? Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, buddy. Oh, he holds two counties. Now I understand. He will say no. 
And I think there are other unhappy people here. You know, of course there are other unhappy people. Let's be honest. I just defeated you in a war. But what are they going to do? If they resist, I can just destroy all of them. You know what? I'm going to... I'm going to do this. I'm going to bring you back here. You're going to take Hull out immediately. I can't actually do this. Because I will never get enough people to actually join in. And uh, I need the, the title of Mun. So. Let's revoke this. He will say no. And then, yep. Multiple people will revolt, uh, revolt, but what do I have this man for, if not to quell these kind of rebellions, eh? And with all of these rebellions, we will then also be able to actually revoke all of their titles. Oh, this is perfect. So, in the next episode, we will finish our transition into the Kingdom of England. It is absolutely beautiful. Thank you for watching. What a, what a, honestly... What a tough episode. It almost failed, but then it didn't. Thank you so much for tuning in. I also want to explicitly thank my members, Hermann and Benedict. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I appreciate it a lot, and it honestly means the world. If you want to support the channel as well, then check out the membership program. And I want to say, sorry for forgetting in the last episode, I want to thank you a second time, Hermann and Benedict. Thank you so much for being the members. It actually means so much to me. And with that, I will let all of you go. We have landed in England. Our borders are everywhere. We are true sea kings because we literally have no uh, land connections. And after we quenched this rebellion, we will be the kings of the world. I will see you in the next one. Later. Alligator.